In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to get stretch resolution in full screen mode in 2025. And with the method I'm going to show you guys today, you can change your stretch resolution in game. So right now I'm on 1720 by 1080, but if I want to use 1680 by 1050, I can just change to that one and use it right away. Also at the end of today's video, I'm going to be showing you the best stretch resolutions that pro Fortnite players use. For this method, you don't actually even need to close Fortnite, but I just did it for the sake of this video. But anyways, the first thing you're going to need to do is right click on your desktop, click show more options, then click into the NVIDIA control panel. You can also just search it up in the search bar if you want to, but I just like to do that. And the first thing you want to do is in the change resolution tab, you're going to click customize right here. After that, make sure this checkbox right here is checked and click create custom resolution. Next, after that, you can put in any stretch resolution you want. So for fun, I'm just going to do 1080 by 1080. Once you have that in, click test. And then this screen will pop up and you'll have to click yes before the countdown. Also during this, your screen will flicker a lot, but it's okay, nothing's broken. And after that, you're done with this part. You can click create custom resolution again and put in all the resolutions you want, and then check all the ones that you wanna be able to see in game. And finally, just click okay right here. Next, you have to go to adjust desktop size and position, and make sure this says perform scaling on display, and make sure this says aspect ratio. And once you select it, you may have to click apply. And most tutorials used to end like that, but now Fortnite tried to patch it, so you have to do something different to get it to actually work. So click your Windows key and search Device Manager. And just open it right here. Now under the Device Manager, go down to Monitors, and you're going to actually want to click right click on all of them and disable all of the devices. Now this sounds bad, but actually for some reason it doesn't even do anything to your monitor, and then on Fortnite it lets you use stretch resolution in full screen. Then this will pop up and it says disabling this device will cause it to stop functioning, but it's not actually going to do that, so just click yes. And then continue and disable the rest of the monitors. And now that you're in game, you should have stretch resolution. And now I'm going to be going over the best stretch resolutions that your favorite Fortnite pros use to be good at the game. And I'm going to go from least stretched to most stretched. The first one I'm going to talk about is 1720 by 1080. This one is used by many pros like Peterbot, Poyo, and Asian Jeff. And though it's very subtle, once you get used to it, it's very good for not taking away much of your FOV, but still giving you less input delay. Anyways, the next stretch resolution I'm going to talk about is 1680 by 1050. This one has one of the lowest delays out of any of the stretch resolutions I'm going to talk about in today's video. And this is one of the first one players started using like Mongrel back in OG Fortnite. So it's not as good as it used to be with OG stretch resolution, but it's still pretty good. Anyways, the next one I'm going to talk about is 1440 by 1080. And this one's actually a 4 by 3 aspect ratio. So unstretched, this is actually what some laptop players play with. And also Martaz is known for using this one. It's really good for being such a stretch, stretch resolution, and a lot of people use it. The next one I have, which is actually going to be the most stretched on my list, is 1280 by 1024. Martaz used to use this one, and this is probably the most stretched that you ever want to go. It reduces your FOV a lot, but it does make it way easier to hit other players. And this one's actually really tiny. As you can see on my monitor, unstretched, this is barely there. And you may notice I said that this would be the last stretch resolution, but at the beginning of the video, I mentioned I would be doing five. And the fifth one is actually not a stretch resolution. I kind of lied to you, but this one is actually a widescreen resolution. So to do this, you're going to have to actually go back to the NVIDIA control panel, go to the adjust desktop size and position tab, and click no scaling right here and apply it. And the stretch rush for this one is 1920 by 720. As you can see, there's black bars on top and bottom, but this actually gives you way more FOV. So if you have a decent PC and you can take the FPS hit, the extra FOV can really help sometimes. Anyways, if this helped you, like and subscribe and comment down below any questions you have for me.